Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com. Today we're going to show you how to route the Dell Streak. So if you're not over there, head over to TheUnlocker.com, spell like that in the address bar, and search for how to route the Dell Streak procedure. Okay, before we begin, this should work on all Dell Streaks, including the new US version. Okay, first we need to know what uh, version uh, build our phone has. So we're going to have menus, settings, bound device, and then you'll see build number down here at the bottom. Mine's 6601, which means I have an AT&T US Dell streak. Um, but remember whatever that number is, and then go to the next step. Can I need to download the Superboot files for that build? So for me, it was a 6601. Uh, it's the same for 4399. Otherwise, if you have 3883, download this one. So since I have this, I'm going to click on that and download that. Okay, so we're going to turn off our phone. And then we're going to take out the battery. Wait a few seconds. Put the battery back in. Okay, now we're going to turn the phone on by holding down the camera button and power at the same time. And keep holding them. Okay, and you can let go once you see that waiting for SD uh, screen. We're gonna tap fast boot up at the top. It should say waiting, wait for USB fast boot detect. So wait 10 seconds. After you've waited 10 seconds, we're gonna plug the phone in via the USB cable to our computer. And it should show fast boot mode on the screen. Okay, now we're gonna unzip the file that we downloaded earlier. So right click extract all, then we're going to open that folder, open the one inside, and we're going to look for install superboot windows.bat, which is right here, and we're going to double click that. And uh, if it pops up the warning, just say run, and wait for it to do its thing. Once it's done, the phone should reboot itself, and so then we can unplug it. And now you should be able to click here on the application drawer, click more, and scroll down and you should see the little super user ninja, so long as you have him, you have root access. Okay, optionally you can go and load a custom ROM now. Uh, to do so, just click on our link at the bottom of this procedure and you'll be taken to that procedure with that video.